Peter was has been a great help for the last like five years. We were able to uh, to fight crime. We were able to, uh, to to reclaim lost children. We were able to help people fight fires like that. We were able to also to tell the youth whenever there's any kind of unemployment. And um, of late, since May this year, the short code for 8988 that was connected to, to Safaricom is no longer working. Which means that now we are not able to, we are not able to to reach people nowadays. In case something happens, we are not able to to get people to to come and help. See, this thing was was a way of making distress call. Whenever somebody is attacked at night, they would call me or put on Twitter, and the neighbors would come and help. Because sometimes you find that it's not easy or practical to have every police officer by every household. But this one, the, the, the policing was done by the people themselves, people helping each other. It was very effective. But now for the last three months, uh, crime has gone, gone, gone up. I remember like uh, there are about three incidences now. One is a, a education officer working from county government in Yandawa. He was attacked around 2 a.m. in the morning. The neighbors called me, but for me, I could not be able to do much that time because I could not allow the other people to come and help. So my work is to call the police, the police now to travel all the way from Makuru to come and help. On Twitter, I have 66,000 followers. But those ordinary people who are subscribed to me that do not have Twitter accounts and uh, they do not have smartphones, and they, get, they were getting a tweet in some form of text message of 14,000 people. And those are the people we have, the Mamamboga. The people who cannot be able to, have, to access the internet. Those, we have lost them. Those are the people we've been talking each day of our lives. We have lost all those people.